Counter-Strike Global Offensive lagging? This is what you can do. Counter-Strike Global Offensive is not really a pretty demanding game. As a matter of fact, whatever hardware we have in or recent notebooks and gaming PCs can run this game quite nicely at around 50 to 60 FPS. If you have a decently specced gaming PC with, let's say, a GTX 1650, you can even get to 80 or 100 FPS. But let's be honest, a stable 60 FPS gameplay is what a normal guy like me would prefer. Still, many players report certain lags and stuttering issues during their gameplay. So what's causing that? Well, in this video, we will be talking about 12 reasons why your CSGO is lagging or stuttering. Number 12. Use Steam Voice Chat Only use Steam Voice Chat for communicating with your teammates. Using third-party chatting apps like Skype or TeamSpeak can ruin your gaming experience as they have very high bandwidths. This can affect your gaming experience and this might be the reason why your game lags. So, always Steam Voice Chat to communicate with your mates. Steam Voice Chat's latency is quite low as well, making it ideal for in-game communication. Number 11. Scan your PC for viruses. Scan your PC for viruses every day. These days, people might even be getting your GPU access without you knowing and use your GPU for mining, making your gaming performance slower than it should be. So always check for viruses and malware. This process is known as crypto jacking and it heavily affects the graphical performance of your game. So always have a nice antivirus and scan your PC regularly. Number 10. Your Graphic Card Driver Well, graphic cards normally automatically update their drivers. However, if that doesn't happen, this will cause certain stutters and lag in your gameplay. That doesn't mean your CPU is weak. That doesn't mean your GPU is weak. That doesn't mean that you have to install more RAM or an SSD. These might be problems in this case, but at first, you should check your GPU driver as, in most cases, Having a GPU that's not updated can cause these stutters. Number 9. Check your network Being a multiplayer game, CSGO requires a stable internet connection with low ping. If your game is running with high ping, your game will lag terribly and might even crash. And even though you might have a stable and fast internet connection, you might still experience lag if you don't play with the proper network settings. Here are some commands you must use while playing the game. CL underscore interp. This command sets the interpolation ratio in Counter-Strike Global Offensive. You can set the amount to the lowest possible number, let's say 0.01. However, it won't become zero. Even if you set it to zero, it will set itself to 0.01. CL underscore interp underscore ratio. This command sets the ratio for the interpolation time. We'll recommend that you keep the ratio to 2. CL underscore CMD rate Sets the number of packets being sent to your PC. If you're running the game on more than 100 FPS, set the value to 128 FPS. Otherwise, keep it to default settings where the rate is set to 64. CL underscore update rate This just updates the number of packets you send. Set the same amount that you set for CMD rate. Default is 64 and the maximum number of packs that can be sent is 128. Number 8. Reduce the graphics Even though Counter-Strike Global Offensive is a reasonably stable game for most of the recent notebooks and gaming PCs, and considering that players love to play the game with maxed out graphics, they often suffer many lags due to the fact that their PC just can't handle that much load and more graphics equals more load. So if you don't have a high spec PC, we would recommend you to lower down your graphics and textures so that you have a pleasant gaming experience. Also, if you want more frames than 60, lowering down the graphics can make your gameplay much smoother. Number 7. Outfox one of the most common issues that Counter-Strike Global Offensive players witness is a ridiculously high ping 
making their gaming experience absolutely miserable. To fix this problem, gamers can use third-party applications like Outfox to properly optimize your PC game. So, Outfox bypasses the network congestion that is resulting in lagging. Outfox has servers that use direct peering and connect directly to game servers, providing you a smooth gaming experience. It's easy to get started with Outfox's fastest server option as the application will pick the route with the lowest ping possible. Number 6. Kill Ping Another game optimizing software that you can use to get the lowest ping possible is Kill Ping. Kill Ping can reduce your Counter Strike Global Offensive ping up to 60%. Kill Ping uses the easiest and most pingless routing paths while ensuring your data is safe and prioritized. Kill Ping makes sure that the distance between you and your server is as short as possible so that you get connected easily and don't experience a lot of ping and frame drops. Kill Ping definitely enhances your Counter-Strike Global Offensive experience and many gamers use this application to make their CSGO experience smooth. Number 5. Check Background Open Apps Applications like Chrome take up a lot of your RAM and if you have opened multiple tabs behind, it puts a lot of load on your PC and takes up a lot of your RAM. Let's say your PC has like 4, 6, or 8 gigabytes of RAM, which is low for multiplayer games these days, but still, low-spec gamers manage to game with that much RAM. But if you're playing Counter-Strike Global Offensive while having multiple tabs of Google Chrome or any other intensive application open behind without having enough RAM to accommodate everything, you will experience a lot of lag in your gameplay. So always close down your background unnecessary apps while playing CSGO so that you don't suffer a stuttering experience. Number 4. Increase RAM To have a smooth Counter-Strike Global Offensive experience, you must have at least 8GB of DDR3 memory. You can still run the game with 4 or 6 gigs of RAM, but it just won't be smooth you will have to lower down the graphics to the lowest possible settings to have a smooth gaming experience and get around 30 to 40 FPS, which is not a great number when we talk about multiplayer shooters. Number 3. Graphics Card Your graphics card is also a very important factor in your Counter-Strike Global Offensive gaming experience. You can't game with a 1 gig graphics card you will need at least 2 gigs of graphics memory in your PC or laptop. In laptops, if you own a recent model with an 8th, 9th, or 10th Gen i7, i5, or even an i3 processor with Intel graphics, you can run the game at around 40 to 50 FPS on average at low settings, which is just borderline playable. Number 2. Stop All Updates and Downloads Updates and downloads are your biggest enemies while playing Counter-Strike Global Offensive, so to have a decent gaming experience, stop all the ongoing updates and downloads so that your game gets the packets it needs to run smoothly. Also, stop all torrents while playing Counter-Strike Global Offensive. It causes a lot of lag while running in the background. If you have a lot of RAM in your PC and a high bandwidth internet connection, you can have a few downloads running in the background, but if you have an ordinary internet connection with average speed, you'll have to close down or at least pause downloads. Number 1. Don't game on public networks Play Counter-Strike Global Offensive on your dedicated internet connection. Don't use public Wi-Fi for gaming as the ping will be really high there and you can barely game. And yes, Game on server locations that are the closest to your region for the smoothest possible gaming experience. If you live in India and play on US servers, the experience won't be great and the game will lag. And yes, do not use proxy or VPN in the background while playing the game as it will increase your ping so much that your game will become a stuttering mess. So, we hope you will use these methods to make your Counter-Strike Global Offensive experience smooth and lag-free. If you liked the video, press the like button. 
If you're new to this channel and like our content, subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon to get notified whenever we post something on our channel. Till then, happy gaming.